This video will show you how to set up multiple Minecraft servers on your computer. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do here is make a uh, Minecraft folder. Uh, call it, and we're going to call this one uh, Minecraft Server 2 because we've got a, multi, a Minecraft Server 1 for our first set of worlds and all that. Um, and uh, so we're going to put all of our uh, downloaded content into that one. Now we already have it on the computer once already. We're saving it in a second folder so that we can have separate worlds that are not going to be affected by each other. The basics to this uh, is basically just uh, setting up an extra port uh, so that your friends can log onto your computer and it'll direct it to the one the uh, world that's going to be in this uh, folder as opposed to the uh, ones in the other. You can run multiple ones at the same time, but keep in mind that at a minimum it's running, uh, it, you're, you're allotting one gig of RAM to each of them, so the more you have, the slower your computer is going to end up running. So you can log into your uh, um, your router here and for more instructions on how to like find out what numbers you're supposed to be punching in in these things uh, we have a link right here to our previous video which goes into more detail and that's about setting up just Minecraft server in the first place but if you need a refresher to figure out what to do um, you can go there so we're just going to um, set up a uh, different number you see in, in here in the old one we sent everything to port 25565 uh, with this one, we're going to send it to port 25566. Um, so uh, that's what we're going to put in here. As you can see with the old one, we've already got the old one in there. That's where uh, um, friends of ours have been uh, getting through to our computer so that they can use our server. So we, on our computer, uh, we have to set up the TCP and the UCP separately. So uh, that's what we're doing now. Um, so as you can see, we're going to have we have all four in there now. Two uh, protocols there for one of them, and two for the second one here. So now we're going to go in here and change this. This is in the uh, Minecraft Server 2 folder, and put that there to 2566, and we saved it. And I like to check these things because I'm always paranoid. It's there. Uh, so that's basically it for um, what to do. So now it's just a case of launching the uh, the Minecraft server. Uh, for this world, and it won't interfere with the other world at all because, of course, it's all in another folder, so all of your save files and everything that's keeping track of things is staying in, in separate, like they're, they're in their own corners type thing. Um, so, okay, we're going to launch the uh, the game server here, and we'll see, we should see a bright, fresh new world as opposed to the one we've been working on, and... Hello, Mojang. Okay, multi oh, I forgot about this part here, sorry. Um, okay, so we're doing a direct connect. The, the way you, that you can, you have to differentiate between them now is you have to, in addition to putting like the, um, the gateway there, you have to type in that 256, 25566 now to let you know that this is a, a new world and this is the one that's accessed. So if you wanted the old one, you'd do the same thing, but it would be colon 25565. Anyway, simple as that. Thanks for watching our video. If you have any questions or comments, uh, just leave them down below and we'll try to get back to you. Or if you just want to say hi. Of course, uh, it'd be great if you liked the video, if you uh, shared it, liked it, subscribed. All those things are great. We enjoy them all. Um, we've got other channels as well. And we also have a uh, Facebook page, uh, which uh, so just you can just check out uh, Punchy Vision on Facebook. Or you can just uh, click the link below and it'll take you there. Anyway, have a good day.